Hello everyone, this is me, Satya here, and I'm back with the first week of September read. Start from the 1st through the 7th of September 2022. This reading is going to be for the sign of Virgo. So let's see how the first week of uh, September is going to be for all of you out there. I will be adding messages from your person, color cards, and oracle cards in this reading. So stay tuned. And before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it is a general read. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that resonate and leave the rest. For person reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see. <clears throat> what is coming up for workers for the first week of September time? Ace of Swords, Page of Cups, The Tower, The Death, The Chariot, Seven of Wands. Underneath the deck, we do have the King of Cups. I really see that um, you might see some sort of positive change in 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 um. In a person that you are dealing with right now um, maybe you have had a lot of uh, ups and downs with this person in the recent times but i feel like you know situation is uh, heading in the right direction for majority of you there is going to be a lot of understanding that you will be having around how they are behaving with you right now and why they are behaving so with you right now as well um i feel like you know there will be um you know um there will be a lot of things that that would be changing in the coming days to weeks time i feel like you know somebody's understanding um you know here that they have love and feelings for you and uh, but at the same time they they find it very hard to take out time for you so i really feel like maybe this person is going to come and confront their feelings to you but at the same time they might tell you that um you know i really don't have time for this i try my best to manage love work home life but i find it very hard so i feel like you know that's that's that has been the issue in this connection for majority of you and i feel like you know what what the uh, what the thing uh, what what is that thing that is changing for you in this week time is you understanding that it was never you it was never like you know are you to blame in this situation it was always your person's own for you know uh, uh individual situations that they were dealing with which was definitely um kind of like you know messing things up and um uh, and I feel like, you know, it's it's uh, them going to be like, you know, uh, confessing that to you. They are going to let you know or reveal to you in a way or two that they have always had feelings, love for you. But at the same time, this is the max that they can do right now for you towards this connection for, for this connection for themselves as well. They they do have a lot of ups and downs in their personal life right now as well which is the reason why the love life that you have with this person is affected but at the same time them coming and expressing um their you know what goes behind the curtains is is something which is going to release the stress that you might be taking around like maybe it's about you maybe they don't like you maybe they don't love you they don't have feelings for you or something like that they have feelings and love for you they they have you know all um that you would want them to have for you but just that the circumstances that you both are in right now is definitely not in the favor for this connection because something or the other always comes up for this person where they find it very hard to maintain a balance so that's what is coming in um in this week time i feel like you know that clarity is going to bring a lot of peace in this situation especially if you're feeling that you are left out or you're always like ignored by your person i feel like you know that is going to change in this week time as well because you're gonna feel like okay fine it's it's a uh, it's something uh that has nothing to do with you it's not that they don't love you it's not that they don't they don't want you it's just that they are occupied with something or the other which is the reason why they are uh, they don't talk to you much or they don't uh, you know give much time to you so clarity would be coming in for you uh let's see what two colors could be lucky or significant for you in this uh, week time let's see so we have two colors one is definitely purple and the other one is also a shade of purple which is mauve so we do have mauve enjoy clear hearing number 43 and uh, purple developmental clarity number 39 for some of you it could be age 39 and 43 or these numbers could be significant for you as well i feel like you know um it's very important for you to develop mental clarity and then enjoy clear hearing as and try to be you know try to clear your clutter and uh, clear the cl clutter that you have in your head about the whole situation it's very important for you to get the mental clarity around where 
the connection is and where it is going to go and i feel like and it's very important for you to have open communication with this person so things will get clear for both of you where where you know where you both stand for each other in this connection let's see some oracle cards here <coughs> Let's see what else is coming up for you for this week time. Higher learning. You have learned from experience for more inner studies now required for further progress. I feel like, you know, the divine really uh, want you to know that you have grown, mature, and uh, you know how to deal things now, and uh, you are, you know, mature enough to deal with them in a better way. Plus, having said that, the divine really want you to learn from what the mistakes that you've made and how you have dealt with the situation and try not to deal with these situations that way so whatever it is that um you know it's, it's more like your person really wants this connection but at the same time they feel that they will not be able to maintain the balance um between the work and love so maybe you 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 have to kind of adjust your demanding nature around the whole situation and if you if that can happen your person would give in to the connection more than what you expect try not to have high expectations from this person and the more you expect less from this person the more surprises that you're going to be receiving from this person the more you are having high expectation the more this person is going to disappoint you so uh try to try to um have the strength to um to deal with this in a in a in a way where you could uh, handle the situation better because i feel like you know i know this this could be tough for you not to get what you want for this person as in, in terms of time you want them to spend more and more time with you you want them to be giving you want them to be also understanding towards your needs they will but right now the circumstances have uh, have been so that this person has been unable to give you time so it was not or it was never about you it was about the circumstances you have no idea what this person is currently going on in their personal career uh, life so try to be understanding and uh, move back to wholeness recognize that you have uh, you have the power now it's very important for you to understand that you have the power to change everything uh, especially if you have been thinking like you know they don't love you they don't love they don't want you they don't want uh, to prioritize you this and that I feel like you know you can always change all that you've been thinking about and uh, you can replace those thoughts with positive mm -hmm. affirmations and positive thoughts um, where you start saying that oh my god I am their top priority I am becoming their top priority I am you know all that they want now so those affirmations or some more affirmations around the situation that you desire uh, if you use them, your situation with this person is going to change and improve. And also, one more thing. If you think that this person is not spending time with you, means that they are busy with the other person, I feel like, you know, that thought process also needs to be changed. So let's see some messages coming from your person. Let's see what do they have to say here to you. What do they have to say to you? Messages from your person. What do they want to say? So we have a few cards here. Let me put some more cards. <clears throat> what else do they wish to say to you i do see a lot of love and growth and this connection just that the timing is definitely not right here for the two of you to be together for now but you will be things will be better and uh let me shuffle more let's see if we could get some more cards so let's take this one and last deck let's see what is the message from your person? We have this card. So let's start with these ones. You speak to me through music. I know I messed up everything. So this person really believes like, you know, they have been messing things up with you for sure because of the lack of their availability or something. They also believe that you speak to them through music. Like, you know, the music that, you know, you, they hear, they always feel as if you are talking to them through that. You know, the words they say or stuff like that. Do you miss me the way I miss you? This person really wants you to know that they do miss you. They also want to spend more time with you. They also have love for you. That's the reason why they are bringing some clarity that it was never you, it was me, it was my stuff that was going on in my personal life, which was stopping me from from this connection or giving into the connection. So try to be understanding. I thought it was the right thing to do that time. I was wrong. For those of you who aren't in no communication, the communication might start in this very weak time. And your person is also going to reveal to you that why they have been busy. It was never about you. It was always that they had the no time for themselves even so try to be understanding try to be like you know um um try to be kind of uh, gentle and uh, towards yourself and towards this person as well so you should um you know uh see that uh connection flourish uh and nourish so yeah that is pretty much it coming up for you for this uh 
week time. If it was of help, uh, do like, share, and subscribe. And uh, yeah. So, nice in the next week for you guys. Take care and bye.